hello viewers this is ashol rafi once again welcome to this new video where we are going to learn facebook page creation profile and cover photo upload call to action button setup vanity or custom url setup process and we are going to add social media and website link into our newly created facebook page we are going to talk about important settings to stand out in the crowd of facebook business page and finally we'll add some business details or our personal details into our newly created page to finalize the setup so without further ado let me take you to my personal page or personal profile which i have created few hours ago so it was 12 hours ago and now i'm going to use this personal profile to create our new facebook page and going to record the full process to show you step by step what we have to do and where what we have to uh, put all right so without further ado let me click on this create button and then click on page and in this page we are going to get two category section as you can see business or brand and community or public figure so if you are creating a page for any business or if you are creating a page to sell any service then you can choose this option but as i am creating a page for my personal profile so i'm actually going to choose this one community or public figure so i'm going to click on get started and then put my name here and then here on the category i'm going to put blogger and then we have to click on continue so here we are seeing the option to add our profile picture of the page so click on upload a profile picture and then select the picture they that you want to upload and here is the option for add a cover photo so I, we are going to upload a cover photo as well as i already have the photo ready so click on it and then click on open all right so here set up your page up for success so let's see we actually have to click here on this cross icon and i'm seeing the profile picture added but the cover photo is not updated for some reason so here what we have to do we just have to click on add a cover and then upload photo or video and then select the image again all right so here is our cover photo added click on save now i want to add the custom button as you can see here add a button option so click on it you will find many options so you just have to select the one that suits best for your business purpose or page, uh, page use, using purpose all right so for me it's going to be a good option when i click on learn more about your business so i'm going to see here watch video or learn more but if you have other purpose of your business for example if you want to get your customers or potential visitors audiences to contact you then you can put these options as you can see contact us send message call now or you can create it create an email list as you can see here sign up or send email button here all right by using these options and from shop or shop with you will have option like shop now or see offers and if you want to promote any app here is the option use app play game all right so as i want to promote my youtube channel or add my youtube channel i have to click here on learn more about your business and then we have to click on watch video and if you have a blog site then you can click on learn more all right so i want to drive these traffics to my youtube channel so watch video is the good option for me and now click on next and here's the option you'll be able to add a facebook video or a youtube channel link here or any other website link here okay so i'm going to put my youtube link so the youtube link is www youtube.com slash rafi as a door click on save and as you can see your button watch video and then the button is configured and we can click on finish and now if we just go to test the button let's click uh, hover over here and then you'll find this test button click on it to see if the link is working for you and here we go i have got my youtube channel appeared after clicking on the button all right so it's working let's see what else we have here so we have added call to action button profile and cover photo 
and now we i'm going to show you the process how you can change your url or how you can get your custom url for your business page okay to do this you have to click on about here is the option general settings uh, username as you can see create page username so as i have created this page just now i might not going to be able to change this username so let's see if we are going to be eligible to change the name Achro rafi okay so you are not eligible to create a username so to create a username you might we have to spend about five to ten days okay and then after these days or after reaching out to our first 10 likes then we'll be able to create a custom username for for our uh, facebook page all right so now let's click on cancel and let's move on to the next option here which is add social media and website link let's go here here enter email address let's start from entering email address phone number and other details okay so let's click on enter email address and if you don't want to put your email address you can always select this option my page doesn't have an email address all right then click on save and then we have got the website information option and uh, let's put if you don't have a website then you can always select this option my page doesn't have a website but as i have one i'm going to copy and paste the website url here it is website url and then click on save all right and now we have to add our social media profiles and to do this we have to click on edit other accounts click on add account and here is the first option is for instagram so let's take our instagram profile instagrams.com slash ajharografi is my instagram profile url so i'm fairly active on instagram and facebook page i'm going to be active on facebook page so let's add other options here uh, let's add twitter and then if you want to add more uh, social media profiles such as snapchat twitch line wechat or other any other option as you can see here you can do that by following the process as i have done all right so click on save and here we go our social media profiles has been added along with uh, youtube channel all right and then we have got our story section and to add story we are going to click on uh, tell about your business and then we'll be able to add a header image here uh, let's put my cover photo in, in this case all right and then this title okay story of my success and the other things how i got started professionally etc etc and i'll make some adjustment after uh, recording or completing this video recording all right so that it won't be long and now click on publish so if you're uh, creating a business page for your client your client should give you uh, this story okay and other information and i don't want to add a phone number so i am actually going to skip this option and let's see what else we have here we have got edit affiliate affiliation so as we don't have any affiliation with any company so we don't have to put anything here then i have got edit about so we have got 255 characters to use hi journey okay so click on save all right so here is our about page and then edit affiliation we don't have edit into some yeah, here we don't have to put anything edit biography so in this case connected all right so then click on save you should have your biography as well and then we have got edit awards if you have got any award then you can add them here so let's put on uh, gender information mail and then you need personal information if you want to put any personal information that's uh, uh, if it suits, suits your interest then you can put your personal information here so I'm not interested so let's keep it blank 
and then we have got uh, nothing more to be worried about here so if you want to add any team member you'll be able to add as well but let's see what else we have got important settings so we want to talk about the important settings and to, to talk about them we just have to click on settings and here is the option page visibility so if you want to get people to find your page you always have to keep it keep your page as published as it is so sometimes uh, for our modification or to make any change we usually keep page unpublished but to give your viewers or audience get access to your page you have to click on page published click on save and then visitor posts anyone can publish to the page anyone can add photos and videos to the page so i always keep this option like review post by other people before they are published to the page okay so if someone try to make some spammy post or if you if someone uh, try to make your reputation down then you will have the option to review their comments or uh, posts and then you will uh, publish it or you will delete it as it goes okay so after that news page audience and visibility of post the ability to narrow the potential audience for news feeds and limit visibility to on your post is turned off so always click on allow so if you want to get your post uh, not be seen by some people or some place based people then you will have the option to uh, uh, turn on as well okay so post and story sharing we don't have to work on this message people can contact my page privately so if you want to get message from people on your facebook page then you can always keep it allowed but if you don't want click on uncheck so that no one will be able to send you a message all right so i want to keep on allow as i want to get connected with people all right so taking taking ability ability only people who can who help manage my page can tag photos posted on it and we have other options as, as well allow others to tag photos and videos published by Azure so i want to keep on allow and then others tagging this page so people and other pages can tag my page so that's fine no problem page location for effects other people can use your page location for photo and video uh, frames and effects okay so i actually don't want this option and then here country restrictions so if you want to get your facebook page to uh, not to be seen by some specific country based people for example i if i want if i don't want to get my profile visible on uh, from the from bangladesh based people's united states based people so what i actually have to do i just have to click here and then i have to put them uh, put these countries like bangladesh this is my country i i obviously i obviously want to uh, get people's watching my page from my country and from united states so this is just to show a uh, learning purpose of you okay so here is the option click on save so that people from bangladesh and united states which people will not find your page anymore all right so i actually don't want that and here only show this page to viewers in these countries if you select this page and if you uh, put bangladesh or any other specific country then only this country based people will be able to uh, see your page or find your page okay so now let's talk about age restrictions so if you have got contents that are actually not suitable for certain uh, certain number of age based people so as you can see here anyone 30 30 13 plus anyone people 17 and over so if you select for example people 20 and 21 and over then the people who has 13 years old 18 years old um, in the in the birth date then though they, they're not going to be able to see your page okay so i want all age based people to watch my or see my page okay so let's keep it as it is then page moderation no words are being blocked from the page so if there if you want to uh, uh block any spammy word for example if uh, any hate speech or any uh, slang etc etc bad slangs okay then you can put them here so that if anyone is going to use these slangs or words into your uh, any any post comment then this will be automatically removed automatically got hidden okay so it will it will save your reputation and then profanity filter turn off so i actually uh, keep it uh, turn off 
as you can see if anyone going to post uh, anything about sexual things or any other uh, bad things then it actually called profinity all right so i want to keep it turned off similar page suggestion choose whether your page is recommended to others i always want to include my page to be appeared on others um, similar page suggestions okay so that i'll get more subscribers or actually likes and followers okay and then page update i don't we don't have to work on this post in multiple language we don't have to work on this comment ranking so most recent commands are shown of my page by default that's great content distribution download facebook okay i don't want these things to be work on and then you have got remove page delete your page if you want or live commentary so uh, that's it for this general settings and then what we have to do we have to uh, go here on page rule so if you want to add any people to manage your page as an editor or admin or moderator and ad advertiser analyst each one has different types of roles okay so you, you'll be able to do that by adding their name here or by putting their email address here okay and then you just have to click on add and then after putting clicking on add you uh, facebook will ask you to provide your uh, facebook password okay so after that they will get a request uh, invitation and if they accept they will be able to edit manage your facebook page okay and let's see what else we have actually for now we don't have much to talk about in this video so we are actually going to learn more about digital marketing in future videos facebook marketing instagram marketing twitter marketing linkedin marketing and other uh, aspects so to get these videos please don't forget to subscribe to my channel to be connected with me and if you have found this video helpful please like this video and subscribe to my channel to learn more i hope to see you in the next video thank you very much for watching